Hey, some friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Symptomistic, like Optimistic, but Make It Sims. And I am doing a Create a Sim video. And this is still growing together, but this is not a new LP. Okay, just so we make that clear. So, this is a new family that I am putting in my founder save file. Now, I feel like a lot of you are newish and might not have gone back and watched this founder's save LP. Well, it's not really an LP, but the playlist. And first of all, you should go watch that. But let me just explain to you what it is and why you should watch it. So the founder's save file is basically an empty save file that I started. So all the sims moving into that save file would have a reason to be like in a newly developed town. Like we have a mayor trying to like build his reputation. We got some businessmen. We have some people that are fresh out of school, some people that are retired, just people looking for a new, first of all, they're not people, so come on, Symptomistic, Sims <laughs> looking for a new life. And so I have them all move into this save file, so they all kind of have like those storylines. And initially it was supposed to be like a LP kind of vibe, but then it kind of turned more into current households, which I think is accurate. And currently what I've been doing with those sims and now they're in townies and other save files. And so if I haven't used them very much, you're not super familiar with them, I tend to drop them in other save files. So you might see them around. They might pop up here and there. And yeah, that's the sims in the save file. Now that we're like a minute into the video, let me tell you who Blake Withers is. First off, Pixel Thirst, yes. Yes. Okay. As long as that's established. Now, Blake is a football player. He just got signed American football, if any of my some friends are not in the States. So when I say football, I mean the pigskin, essentially. <laughs> and so he is a football player. He and his wife, who is essentially like his, what do they call it? Like a high school high school sweethearts. They are high school sweethearts. They are moving to this new town so he can play football. He's very excited. He feels like they're getting money. They're both excited about it. In the grand scheme of things, it's probably actually not that much money, but they from they're they're from like humble beginnings, lower middle class kind of lifestyle and they feel like they're getting a lot of money. And wow, we zoomed through his <laughs> Like, I'm just realizing how fast we went through his. Don't worry, I will, like, slow it down at the end so you can see him. But we zoomed through Blake. So we're going to talk about Blake a little more, even though Chauncey is on the screen. Chauncey, his wife. So, yeah. So, essentially, they moved and they are just starting this new life. And I felt like this was perfect for growing together. I do not put them in San Sequoia. So... Maybe I'll do a current household. Let me know if you want to see a current household with them. They have a fabulous house. Well, it's kind of old, but like the outside is fabulous. And yeah, they're very excited. Chauncey over here is very excited to be a football wife. She is, that's kind of always been her plan. Like, I think everyone always knew that Blake was going to be in the NFL. It wasn't kind of like a surprise. I mean, there are slim chances, but there are certain people that's kind of like the track that they're on. So not a full surprise. And also, I wanted to make both of these sims like, I don't know what the proper word is, like kind of country or, I mean, I guess they don't have, they could be from like the city. Country might be the wrong word, but like slightly trashy I don't trashy has such a negative connotation and it's not intended that way but just not they're not the most fashionable they're not like giving certain aesthetics like I just wanted them to kind of just be figuring themselves out like they're young they're also very young and they're new to this like bougie life I wanted that to come across that like the bougie life is new to them, even if they feel like they're bougie. So they may spend their money on the wrong things sometimes. They're just kind of figuring that out. And 
An important thing to know is that Chauncey is pregnant and that's what she wanted. That's what her and Blake wanted. They, you know, they feel like, again, they're making a lot of money that they can start their family right away. And yeah, she's pregnant. You cannot see in these in cast quite yet but you know if I do a current household you will see her as pregnant and let's talk a little bit about traits because I don't feel like I got to do that at all I mean literally it took me so little time to make Blake I feel like he came together so quickly and he looks amazing like one of my best looking sims male sims and it took me no time and I feel like, honestly, Chauncey didn't take that much time. I just spent more time on, like, her fashion and her hair and her makeup. But, like, she didn't take any time either. And she, I feel like, I wanted her to look kind of cute. Like, I gave her, like, round features and chubby cheeks. I wanted her to look, like, cute and kind of young. And so, yeah, their traits. One of the ways that they've bonded is that they both are active sims and they enjoy being active. And one thing I wanted to make Chauncey was I wanted to make her high maintenance. And I feel like I can do that with a sim that's a current household sim. Frankly, the high maintenance trait is kind of annoying. There's constantly something wrong with the sim. And so, like, I feel like that works for a sim that I don't play with too much. But, you know, like, I wanted her to kind of feel like she deserved this life. Like, she's also a loyal sim. And so I want her to feel like, you know, her being this football player wife, like, she feels kind of uh, special. Even if, like, you know, that doesn't really mean anything. She feels like she might be a little better than some people. and that'll we'll deal with that as that that goes on in the the current household and I also wanted her to have like kind of a creative aspiration I don't know a lot of the aspirations that I usually choose weren't in my game I use a lot of Kiara Sims for mods aspirations and so I don't know I do I'm gonna do the best with what I got and yeah let's talk a little bit more about his traits so Blake, in addition to being active, is also a goofball and a perfectionist. Now, I know those things kind of seem like they are opposed, but they're not as opposed as you might think. He likes to joke around. He feels like that helps him like connect with other people. Most people that know him think of him as a fun guy, but I think on the inside, he does. he's very concerned with how things look. And whether he's like achieving enough, whether him and his wife are blending into this new crowd. So he is a perfectionist, even though he may have a sense of humor, he takes his life very seriously. His aspiration is to have like a big successful family. And, you know, he may be hard on himself and Chauncey about those things. And so that'll just be interesting to see how it plays out. And I can't believe we're almost at the end of the video, <laughs> like this video I had on. I hope it wasn't too fast for y'all. I'm sorry if it was, but I feel like sometimes, you know, these cast videos can go on and on and on and I will slow it down at the end so you can see all their outfits and their beautiful faces and really enjoy them. But I can't wait to hear what you think about this family. I just kind of made them on a whim and... It's been a while since I put some people in that save file, so it was it was kind of nice. This family also allowed me to use a lot of outfits that I haven't used before, that I haven't used yet. I'm really trying to like make different sims. Like I feel like it's hard not to make all your sims kind of fit the vibes that you have and like the things that you would like to buy or wear. It's really it's really hard to kind of give all the sims their own flavor, and I feel like. I was able to do that a little more with these sims, but y'all can let me know if these look like all my other sims. I won't be mad, I promise. Y'all can tell me. I think Blake was the first sim that I gave braids, I think. Well, male sim that I gave braids, and so that was fun. I had a lot of fun with Chauncey's nails. Like, I made sure they were long, and like, oh, I love Chauncey. 
Chauncey is so freaking cute. Like just looking at her little sunglasses, this hair that I haven't used, which I think is by Blackish Sims. I'm so sorry if it's not, but I'm pretty sure it is. Let me know in the comments if, oh, of course, let me know in the comments if you want anything. Okay, now we can slow down and really look at these beautiful, beautiful Sims. And yeah, let me know in the comments if you want anything, any CC, any questions. I'm symptomistic, like optimistic, but make it Sims. Like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Talk to y'all later, some friends. Okay, bye.